Hey, welcome to my first box break. Well, really just pack break. I got some 1986 Donruss Rack Packs. Excited to open them. I started collecting cards in 86, but just some Topps Packs. I was six years old. 87, I really got into it. I might have completed that set, and I don't think I bought any Donruss cards probably, or I don't think anyone bought me Donruss cards until 1988 when I was eight years old. Of course, at the time, like everyone else, I was a big Jose Canseco fan, so hopefully I pull that card. If not, uh, still should be some fun cards in there. Lots of other cool cards. Uh, rookies for Fred McGriff, you know, Tom and Mansky baseball fame. And Paul O'Neill, Andres Galarraga. These are much harder to open than I anticipated. There we go. Try to keep those corners sharp. Let's see who we have. Look at that. Don Mattingly. That's a cool card. Yeah, that's cool. I'm trying to figure out how best to show these cards in the camera and everything. Um, Chet Lemon. I feel like I got a bunch of those when I was a kid. Later year. Oh, look at that. I was a Blue Jays fan for a while. Kind of neat card. Pedro Guerrero. He was a star for a while. So, obviously, any of the Hall of Famers would be cool. Um, my favorite player growing up was Paul Molitor, which was a strange reason, but I was a Paul Molitor fan. So, hopefully, to pull him. Obviously, Nolan Ryan. These are really sealed in here pretty good. Love to pull that Canseco. Love to pull that. I can't even. I don't know how you guys do these videos so so smoothly and nice. This is hard. <laughs> Terry Francona. There we go. Willie Randolph, Diamond Kings. Hey, that's a rookie card. Harold Reynolds. ESPN fame. I feel like later years I bought a bunch of these cars and uh, loose, you know, pick through, of course. No, was a Brewers fan since I was a Paul Molitor fan, so that's a neat card. Willie Wilson, another star. Yeah, Willie Randolph, regular card. He, he was a star. Still want to pull that Conseco. First pack is not looking good. That's all right. Got one rookie card in the Don Mattingly, so that's cool. Yeah, Joe Carter on top, so that's cool. I'm gonna cheat now and just do scissors because those did not open. Those first pack did not open well for me. Of course, I still don't know what I'm doing. You can tell it's been a long time since I've opened a rack pack. The last time I opened cards was. Probably whatever year each Euro's rookie was, because I remember pulling a uh, Topps Gold, was that what they still did? The, whatever the insert was, and I sold that on eBay and it went to Japan. All right, there's a Joe Carter, Mike Shosha, he was a star. Tim Raines, good player. Yeah, John Franco, he was a good player. Terry Kennedy. No, no big stars in that pack other than the Joe Carter. Yeah. Yeah. Being a Paul Molitor fan, I followed him to the Blue Jays, so obviously, I like Joe Carter as a Blue Jay. I think I was 13 when they won that World Series. Dave Stewart became a star, became a pretty good pitcher with the Athletics with the Bash Brothers. Looking for his little teammate, Jose Canseco, of course. Good pitcher for the Orioles. The local team to me would have been Baltimore Orioles. The cards are crisp. Yeah, rated rookie. Don't remember that guy at all. Ah, yeah, there we go. Danny Tartable. He had some good years. Diamond Kings. Oral Hershiser. Kirk Gibson, someone else who 
played a major role. All these players are from the Dodgers. Yeah, all these players who played a role in the Dodgers against the Athletics in that World Series. Still looking for Conseco. Don't care about the rest of the players in that World Series. Sean Dunstan, he had a good good couple years for sure. I think he was an all-star. Oh, Robin Young. There we go. Hall of Famer for the Brewers. Cool card. Big mustache. Lee Smith. All-time save lever at one time. I don't know. Don't quote me on stats off the top of my head. There we go. Look at that. Raleigh Fingers. Another good brewer. Like that guy. Owns a hotel chain. Just kidding. Harold Baines. All right. Harold Baines is cool because, see what it says it. Cool to me because he's from uh, St. Michael's and my family comes from Cambridge, Maryland, which is really close. Now it's backwards. Lou Whitaker, part of the great duo with Alan Trammell, of course. These videos are much harder to do than look. Eh, Diamond Kings. I never really. I guess, I don't know. Diamond Kings were cool. Anytime you can add more star players to a set, that's probably a good idea. Did anyone ever put the puzzle together? I never did. Vince Coleman, he had a good career. Oil Cam Boyd, I remember him. Hey, good pitcher. There we go. Paul O'Neill rookie card. Looks like it's in pretty good shape, too. Oh, look at that. Fred McGriff rookie card. Tommy Mansky. Everybody remembers those commercials. I'm pulling some of the rookies out. Ricky Henderson, all time stolen base leader. Still looking for that Conseco. Three packs to go. Be cool to pull the Cecil Fitter rookie too. That was a big deal for a couple years. Injuries though. Same with his son. Gotta watch those injuries. Not that you can watch it, but you know what I mean. Grad school, I knew his uh, nephew. There we go. Hall of Famer, Steve Carlton. End of his career. Andre Dawson, the Hawk. I like that player growing up, too. Used to watch all those blue, um, Cubs games. Cubs games on TV. Sid Fernandez had a good career. Spike Owen, he seemed to be pretty decent for a couple years. Brett Saberhagen, I got his autograph at spring training. I think that's his second year card. 85 was his rookie. Can't remember. Goose Gossage. There we go. Ah, George Brett. There we go. Another Hall of Famer. Oh, Rod Carew. Also a Hall of Famer. Late in his career. Craig Reynolds. I remember that name. Phil Necro. Look at that. Guy was like 75, I think. Give or take 25 years. Goose Gossage again. He hit a lot of home runs. Andy Van Slyke. He had a good career. Played for the Pirates for a while. He had a pretty good career, too. Uh, still no Conseco. Oil Hershiser. Another nemesis for those of us rooting for the athletics in the World Series. Yeah, so far I've learned these videos are much harder to do. I don't know what to do about the focus. Just fix, fix focus somehow. Oh, Eddie Murray. Ooh. Local team was the Orioles. I liked Eddie Murray growing up. Sid Bream, big part of a playoff game once. Look at that, second year Roger Clemens. That used to be a really good card. Another Brewer, but not the one I want. One thing, one thing I've learned is these videos are harder to do than they look. Terry Frank Hunter, I think we got him already. Manager, Willie Randolph. Hey, there we go. Second time through. Would have liked to get two Consecos, but whatever. Ah, uh, Diamond King. Couldn't remember what Brewer was the Diamond King that year. Willie Wilson had a good career. Oh no, one full pack and this stack to go. Donnie Baseball. That's a cool card.
He, I remember him. Pulling doubles, but not the one I want. Oh, last pack. George Bell. He had a good career. I think I got his autograph, too, when I went to spring training. I obviously went to see the Royals. Roger McDowell. He had some good seasons. Ah, oh, there we go. Kyle Rook and another Hall of Famer. Local. There we go. He had a couple good seasons for sure. Alright, last section. Looking for the Conseco and the Paul Molitor. Carlton Fisk, Hall of Famer, of course. Jose Uribe, he had some good seasons. Jack Morris, good, great pitcher for the Twins. Yeah, oh, this is disappointing. This does not seem to be going well, people. Oh no, Jim Rice. Oh, no. No. All right, I guess the two best cards were these two, maybe? I don't know. Thanks for watching along. Hopefully next time I pull the really key card and my favorite player.